you know, it sounds like out there in New Jersey, they were having a lot of problems with the, the budget. And they're talking about budget cuts in regards to education. And I'm sure it goes through the secondary education in high school. But I'm sure it affects the college level as well. You tell me, why in the world, why in the world, do you know who Rutgers had at their commencement? Uh, I did see something. I don't remember who it was, but I did see something about that. Who was it? It was the person from, I believe, the Jersey Shore show. Now, what is she doing? I know if the whole theme is about Jersey, but the point is, guess how Snooki. much they paid her. How much did they pay Snooky? Uh, Snooky, Snooky, Snooky. Snooky, Snooky, what's the difference? Snooky, you got to get it right there. Snooky, you got to get it right there. Snooky, you got to get it right there, though. Oh, oh, don't you want the show? Yo, yo, you want the show? Anyway, uh, I believe it's Snooky, and they paid her $32,000. Wow, uh, years and years ago, that's what uh, uh, Shaq got for signing uh, basketballs at uh, different card shows. So that's pretty high. I know. That's why I said they're, they're supposedly have. Hey, stop. Stop for a second. Snucky, Rutgers, come on. Hey, let me ask you a question. At the top, top of the heap, the White House, tell me how rapper, hip-hop artist, Cuban rights advocate, common, made an invitation to the White House. You tell me that over Snucky, the monkey, or whatever his name is. Why? Wow, he had got an invite to the uh, White House? He, he got an invitation to the White House, went there, performed. Now, Pinko Kami Cuban rights, he's an advocate. He, he's over there, he's doing all kinds of stuff. Give Cuba the rights, blah, 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 do this, do that, whatever. Uh, take away the sanctions. Hey, what? And he's at the White House? A guest of your president, Obama? Well, uh, let's face the facts. Uh, even though he's making a, a move a little bit to the center, we have a liberal president in the White House. And I think that his, uh, his, beliefs, uh, his beliefs do not face him in any way. In any way whatsoever, I, I guess somehow he uh, warmed his way into the White House, and I believe his uh, background, his uh, politics, but had his, nothing his to do with it. Advisor, what, what, what's he have a barrel of monkeys around there helping him out? Isn't there White House advisors to tell him, look, the protocol is this, and uh, advocates for Cuba, we may not let come eat at Sunday dinner. Uh, it's just the way things should be in the White House. Well, like I said before, there is a, a liberal in the White House. Anything goes, so I, that doesn't surprise me at all. I'm surprised. I'm shocked and appalled. And, uh, I mean, a, 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 a American true blood, Ted Nugent, was snubbed. Not, but he, he wasn't really snubbed, but he tried to, you know, have a connection with the White House, and they poo-pooed him, and anything he said, they said, we do not agree, we do not accept what Ted Nugent is saying. Ted Nugent, rock star, rock idol, common, a hip-hop somebody hero, a couple movies. Couple songs. Matter of fact, tell me a comment song that you know. Well, I really have to sit down and think about that, but you have to remember which side of the politics Ted Nugent is coming from. He's coming from more of the conservative side, and that's why he was poo pooed out and not allowed in the White House. Hold it. He's a flag waver, so he is 
work on the Republican side, but he's not supporting uh, left-wing radicals and, and communist countries, is he? Uh, no, he's not, but still, he is a conservative. He supports the conservative, so and that's why. Me, so you're telling me that you're okay with uh, Obama's decision to have a uh, advocate for for the, uh, the, the, the the communist Cuba, but a flag-waving American Republican is not the type of person they want in the White uh, House. No, when it comes down, I really have no opinion on that. I mean, that's just, just something there. Uh, you can expect it. It's politics. It's just as simple as that. Well, okay. So now I want your opinion. If you had the choice between Ted Nugent and, and Common, well, what is his real name? Uh, who knows? Uh, Cutney Swole. Or, or, or Ted Nugent. If you were in the White House, which would you invite? Well, let me see. It has to be one. I would think I would invite Ted Nugent because from what I've heard from him, he can tell some great stories. <laughs> and he's not supporting uh, the rights of Cuba. That's yeah, he, it wouldn't make a difference to me. He, he seems like a, a barrel of fun. He can tell you some hunting stories. He can break out the, that guitar. Cat scratch fever. There you go. So, Mr. Obama, think twice next time you're inviting uh, people to the White House. <laughs>